It's one of the fastest growing sports in the country, and we're out today with the Liquid Adrenaline crew as they give us a lesson in wakeboarding. Meet the Liquid Adrenaline TNT crew of Berkeley Barth and Michael Wilshire, two of the guys doing their best to spread the gospel on the waves of wakeboarding. The sport in itself is very popular, and as you can tell, even the ladies can outdo the men on the water. Berkeley says the team has been together for the past seven years, and the sport has literally taken off. Based on the knowledge of it, people knowing about it is going really fast. I mean, people, from the time they hear about it, um, they want to come out and do it. We've our main, um, I would say, um, advertising medium or for spreading the word really is Facebook. So what happens is people will come over with us and they take pictures of them doing, doing it and from the time they put it up on their page or their Facebook page or whatever, their friends see it and they like it and, and we get the calls. <laughs> While the pros can ride the waves, do flips and tricks, for amateurs like myself, this is where safety is a top priority. Once you're operating in water, you, you, you have to be a little more aware. And with us, we always say safety is a practice and not a policy. So there are two sides to the safety. There's safety in the boat and there's safety in the water, right? So safety in the boat is primarily two things, making sure the boat is balanced at all times and being aware of where the rope is that the riders are using because you don't want that to be tangled anywhere. In the water, of course, this is a sport where you fall all the time. Sometimes you can take a hard fall, so we want to know we have visual cues that you sent us, we shout, we have one, one person driving the boat, one person watching the ride at all times. Michael adds that it doesn't take long for one to get a hang of the sport. We don't like to say normally, but I will beat our chest, our collective chest for a second <laughs> here and say that the first time you come out for a half an hour session, you're going to get up and ride. Berkeley, meanwhile, says their goal is really to provide an alternative to traditional sports that are available. We've realized that his, it, it, there's a, a need or one for it because, I mean, Trinidadians on the whole, we know one thing. We know about party, we know about line, we know about fit. When it comes to sport, we know about football, we know about cricket, and that's it. You know, and we have been trying our best with, along with other um, operators, operators you know, to, to give Trinidadians something else to do. I mean, Kent Fuentes, Sea Sports. Mm -hmm.